Hello friends, welcome to Amazon Webcast and in today's video demonstration, we are going to see message moderation for distribution group in Exchange 2016. Sometimes it makes sense to have a second set of eyes on a message before the message is delivered to the users. As an Exchange Administrator, you can set this up. This process is called moderation and the approver is called the moderator. A moderator will be notified each time a message is sent to the group. The moderator will receive a copy of the message and will then able to perform an action against the message. The moderator receive an email with a request to approve or reject the message. The text of the message include buttons to approve or reject the message and the attachment includes the original message to review. So in earlier videos, we just created one uh, distribution group named HR users and you want to set up a message moderation on our HR users group. Let's click on uh, edit. Let's click on the message approval and by default message moderation is not enabled. So let's select this checkbox to enable the message moderation. Now the messages sent to this group have to be approved by a moderator. You can add a group moderator from over here. Remember you can define a multiple moderators but you can assign only users. You can't assign group as a moderator and if you didn't select any moderator the group owner will able to review and the approve messages which are sent to this group and if you don't want certain senders who didn't require approval that time you can add those users over here and once you add that user under this list that users message will be directly delivered to the group members messages are not delivered to the group until a moderator of the group has approved the messages and here it's about the moderation notification. By default selected options is notify all sender when the message aren't approved. Here we have a second options notify senders in your organization when the message aren't approved. And the third one is don't notify anyone when a message isn't approved. And we want to select this notify all senders when the message aren't approved. Click on save and that's it. Now let's open the mailbox of any other users from our exchange organization and let's uh, use the account of Jim Smith. Let's specify the name james.smith at mylab.local. Let's specify the password. Okay, let's click on new. Send a mail to HR users. Okay. Let's specify the subject. Test email for message moderation. Hello. Click on send to send the mail. Okay. Now let's uh, come back on our Exchange Admin Center. Let's open the mailbox of our administrator. HTTPS colon double slash localhost slash wa. Okay, here we have a message from our user James, and your decision is requested. Jim Smith has asked you to approve the attach message for delivery to our group Azure users, and this is the mail preview of our user. James Smith and the only we mention hello. This is the subject and from James Smith to HR users. Now here we have a two button one for approval and second one for reject. Let's approve and that's it. Now the message is delivered to our group named HR users. Now if you approve the message that message goes to the original intended recipients the original senders isn't notified. Now, if you reject the message, a rejection message is sent to the sender. The moderator can add an explanation. If the approver either deletes or ignores the approval message, an expiration message is sent to the sender. Now, let's see. Let's again send a mail to our HR users. Let's add subject, test email to, hello, and click on send. Again, we have a test mail too and now let's reject the message. Now here we have a two options. Edit the response before sending and send the response now. If you want to add an explanation that time select this. 
Now add your explanation over here and then click on send. So that time user will be notified that administrator reject your mail. As you can see, your message was rejected by the moderator for this recipient's name Asha users. And this is your explanation. So this is the way how you can set up message moderation on distribution group in Exchange 2016. That's it for this video demonstration. Thanks for watching this video.